If you're coming to Marrakesh as a tourist, by the way, this main square is sort of the real heart of the old Medina. But be prepared to be invited in by all kinds of snakes and monkeys, yep. musicians, henna, drinks, tea, coffee, everything's going on, and all yep. kinds of sort of trinkets you never knew you needed. Like a shoot off. Oh, I just got a shot. Gordon Ramsay. Yeah. Wow, look at that. One last look now. I'm going to put this down. Satisfied? Good afternoon and salam alaikum from Marrakesh today. We, it's an absolutely stunning day. Look at this. Yes. We're right here again in the center of the Medina and heading, or well, heading to the Medina. And today, well, we're actually Gav's chasing actually down. planned today. Tell yes. us about today. Okay, before so, we go any further, tell us about today. So um, I love um, Gordon Ramsay and his um, chefing abilities, that sort of thing. So I'm tracking down a place that he went to. It's a man by the name of Mustafa and he spit roasts lamb mutton in an underground sort of um, oven. So is it an old place to eat? Is it like an old restaurant? It's mean? extremely old, like it's um, like five generations. Okay. Um, I haven't actually done any research on no. this. This is totally Gav's outing. So yeah, 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 so it's not do you far know where from it is? Yeah. Well, sort of. I've got a Google map of it. We're going to okay. wander towards it and you can get um, mutton, slow spit roasted is mutton. Is it sandwiches? It's sandwiches, yeah. Wicked. Okay. And sandwiches. So we're going to go and check that out and eat some lamb. Some Before slow we roasted lamb. I can see some sugar cane juice. Oh, you oh can. true. Do you want to okay. go get a sugar cane juice? We'll just go and check if our friend is up here that we got yeah. last night. I mean, everyone says, oh, we saw you yesterday anyway. But Gav, I'm really hungry. It's actually after two o'clock in the afternoon. I think it might be like 2.30 or something. So, oh, yeah, so I'm hungry. Let's go and find Gordon Ramsay's favorite place. What is the restaurant called, Gav? Right. We haven't the... actually got any further than we're still standing here by the mosque, we but find it. we need to find what's the name of it? Mustafa. Um, is on. that the guy's name or the name of the restaurant? We are going to need the these stats to share. Okay. Hey, look at this horse and cart going past on the road. Okay, we found it. Okay. Okay. Shailami. Shailami. Okay. Shailami. Shailami. Okay. Shailami. All right. How far okay. a walk is it? We're gonna walk. Ten minutes. Brilliant. Must right. Be just Ten minutes. Here. here we go. Okay. Let's, Let's go, go then. Lead the way. You gotta lead the way. Okay. Right All right. So a beautiful day here in Marrakesh. Like I said before, we're gonna find this guy Mustafa. He spit roasts lamb. Um, it takes about two to three hours underground to spit roast this lamb. I'm told it's the best lamb we'll ever taste. And he just serves it to you basically on bread, no spices, no um, anything like that. Just It's just basically pure. You sound like hungry as you're I'm talking. so hungry because we've actually been sort of prepping ourselves for this so um, <laughs> that's a good I'm, way to be going into it yeah going going look at, hungry look at all this row of horse and carts by the way this is the very center of marrakesh this is the square like the main square this is harry and, and this is oscar and so this is the this square is that comes alive in night time it is so busy so we came out last night in Marrakesh and it was absolutely jam-packed after we'd had dinner. It was, Walking yeah. Back, I don't even know if I would necessarily recommend it so late at night. At least now, I suppose this is the hottest part of the day, so not anywhere else. But True. It feels beautiful the winter. It time. is, yeah. Wow, look at this. What a beautiful afternoon. I wonder originally what this square was for. Like, was it always just a big market? Down square, I guess, in the market, yeah. Maybe, yeah. Real maybe someone could answer Near that for us. Yeah. 
Oh, there's going to be so many juice stalls, we don't have to worry about when. I know, I know. We're actually okay. going to go and get ourselves a juice as well on the way. In route. Let's go down the side and see if we can find the guy from last year we got juice. Yeah. So you'll find everything here from snake charmers to dancing, dancing monkeys. Yeah, let's bypass the monkeys. Oh, hey! No, I don't want to touch a snake. I don't want to touch a snake. <laughs> Get your snakes away from me. <laughs> I'm okay. not interested in having a holding a snake. If you're coming to Marrakesh as a tourist, by the way, this main square is sort of the real heart of the old Medina. But be prepared to be invited in by all kinds of snakes and monkeys, yep. musicians, henna. Drinks, tea, coffee, everything's going on and all yeah. kinds of sort of trinkets you never knew you needed. But you eventually do get to the end of it. How's that map? Um, I know we're going over there. Not my thing, the old snake charming. Where I'm only so going guys, we'll grab ourselves a juice on a the way. Orange. Well, and a may I say, may I say these oranges look very nice. Oh, okay. <laughs> Seeing as they're rock hard. So number 51. 51. Has this got the best, best orange one. juice? Oh, yeah. Is this the best one? Oh. This is the best one? Best one. Nice. Number 51 is the best one. Dad, may I just point out that this is kind of all worn out the colour, and then behind the sticker, it's like fresh. Oh, uh, nice. Oh, he's saying, do you guys want to go in for a picture? Are you all right? Okay. We've got a couple of new vendors I'm and the juice stand here. Number yeah. 51, Marrakesh. What would you like to order, man? I'd like a shoot off. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, yes. Okay, this is it. Mustafa. All right, so here we are. So we found that whether like it's busy or not, this is the one where we've found. Yep. Look how busy this whole street is though. So it looks like there's one, two, three, four, five. And this is basically what they're cooked in. There's five small restaurants along here, plus this one on the end, which looks really nice as well. Equally as good. Um, was it like a bread that they have? Yeah, yeah, Just yeah, meat yeah. and bread? Yeah. Okay, should we try going in? Should we, we try and go in? Let's go. Salam, salam. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. That's where it's cooked. All right, Harry, this is where it happens, look. That's the oven down there? This is the oven. This is the oven. Yeah, it's oven. Wow. There it is. And everything's in there. Oh, look at that. But now we have nothing. Now you have nothing. Sorry. Sorry. And it's very busy. Yeah, in the morning you find 30 ship here inside. Yeah, and what's the name of the, your yeah. restaurant? Uh, Shilamin. Shilamin. Yeah, this is name of restaurant. And how long has it been here? This is from 120 20 years to 130 wow. years. Wow. Wow. And this is yeah, the this man is, himself. Yeah, What's yeah. up for himself? Yeah. Wow. This it's is good the to big be boss. Here. It's good because to be this here. place, generation after generation. Nice. Yeah. Nice. We should ask him um, if he, if Vaughan Ramsey came here. Yeah, I will. Where's mum? Let's go through. Okay, I'm so excited to try this. All right. Okay, we've got to see what we've to clear it. Okay, I did. 
<laughs> wow, it's so fizzy inside here. Um, but we were just saying it's really interesting, the actual oven. Gav showed the oven on the video before, that it's like down on the ground, you walk past. Well, if you come in that entrance, you walk past the oven on the ground. Do you think it should be like raised or something? Well, I think so, because like, as you walk in the door, you walk right past it. Does anyone like, ever else worry about falling in? No, That's I think right. you'd, you'd, you'd fall straight in. Like, it's, a, like. it's a fairly decent opening. Like, you'd fall straight into the hole. Once yeah. if you drop your shoe in. Yeah, that would be Like if you look down, good. I don't know whether you can see it properly on the video, but there's like yeah, six there? whole lambs on kebab. Wow. And then there's, there's just these big pots of like slow cooking meat down there. I think it's those pots that keep coming past and they, it's like they ground the meat up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well that's kind of like a... That's like we in, had in Iran, right? Yeah. Where they ground the meat. Yes, Except so over okay. here they don't grind it up, they yeah. give it to you whole. Oh, right. So, slightly different. Yeah. Um, but yeah, same sort of technique, it's still is it cooking that slow, slow clay pot. Cooking. So if you can remember that yesterday when we went to the hammam, I took you down to the fire. Well, down in the fire, they were in all those little clay pots. Yeah. Um, there weren't many left when we went there last night because we went quite late, but that is the slow cooked meat. So a lot of the restaurants take their meat there, apart from this place, they do it themselves. Which has its own huge oven. Yeah. yeah, but they slow cook the meat down there because those fires are burning 24-7 to wow. keep the hammam water boiling. Um, so the clay pots are all just lined up in the ash, wow. heating up. So, and which has been done for years and years and years. They've done always something like that. How beautiful does it look here, by the way? It looks so sort of iconically. It does. This, it does. Is what it does. this is what it looks, you know, like iconically Marrakesh looks like. It's and iconically like Moroccan. A sewing table of the last. Oh, true. Okay, this is the extra bit of tour there. But yeah, so it is. Anyway, it's really nice to be here. Come on, go wonder how long it takes. This, it's just so, so busy. Also, I ordered a salad as well, but it's mainly it a salad. And it always comes with delicious free too. Yeah. I think we should get tea as well. We'll definitely get tea. So, every table gets laboured bread, that's fresh bread. Nice. So, yeah, our salad's arrived. So this is the Moroccan salad, yeah, it's already eaten all of well. It's just cucumber, onion and tomatoes, I All think, chopped with up, nice and small. So it's yeah. kind of the opposite of like a um, Greek salad where it's big and chunky. Yeah. It's like chopped up finely, so. Totally, that's quite a good description. Otherwise it basically is almost identical in taste, I think, eh? Exactly. Um, yeah. And it doesn't have any feet or anything, it really is just vegetables. Yeah, and olives. And olives, yeah. Okay. okay. It's getting exciting. Maybe it's, maybe the time is near. I hope so. <laughs> so, so hungry. You could try to be patient and not, no. and not, um, not eat the bread. Yeah. Not good at being patient with food's coming. <laughs> no. They tip it. They tip the meat upside down. Here, yeah, I just saw the plate. people over there just got these um, tipped out. What they do? Yeah. So the they get the clay sort of bar. Sort of There's actually one up, one up there. there. Oh, yeah. and they put it over your tagine and they sort of oh, it over and it goes on your plate and you can start using the bread to eat it. And is it good? Well, thanks. Yeah. That's good. Must be coming soon. Um, it smells absolutely amazing in here. Um, all the other tables have got their food, and I'm in suspense to see. We're trying to guess what one of these ladies here are having. It looks like, um, I was thinking maybe that is the feet, is it? I think so, yeah. Okay. We're I can see some hooves. Oh, truly? Oh, no. Too much detail. But we're in suspense anyway. See you now. I'm Come so out. hungry. I know. It is, by the way, about, is it 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock or something? It's like 20 to 4. Okay. So we are very late getting here. We're okay. going to come here much earlier. Yeah. And um, tomorrow it could be one of our first stops. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So, um, it had just arrived and I went and pushed play with them. The GoPro was on time lapse, so you know, here it is. Look at that. So, what's the verdict, guys? Oh, I was just trying the sauce and oh my god, it's so good. Shall we push it into the middle so we can all admire it? And the meat is so tender. Okay, so this is a one kilo, by the way. Look at this, look how tender that is. It's just falling apart. It is falling apart. Hard to film and fall apart, make it fall apart. You just keep look, filming, I'll do the this. tasting. <laughs> look at that. I'm going to taste this. Okay. Oh, it's very lemony. Yeah. 
Wow. Oh, that must be citron, mm. I think. That's a piece of lemon inside or very lemony? It's like that citron. Mm. Wow. Yeah. How's the bread dipped in? Bread is really nice here. The bread is really nice. I think it's fresh bread. We're going to need more bread. In every shop, even if the food, which is probably, this will probably never happen, if the food's not nice, you can always have the bread. It's always good. True. As long as you save me some. Of course. Wow, look at that one last look now. I'm going to put this down. Satisfied? Yeah, no, you yeah. Keep filming. <laughs> and of course, every meal should be washed down with some tea. So they give you uh, two, two sugar cubes and you put it inside the actual tea pot. Put it in, Oscar. Nice. So now we close it up and then we drink. So guys, we made short work of that. That was delicious, yeah? That was so good. <laughs> That was good. Good and delicious. Delicious. Harry's gonna pour the tea. Wow, nice pouring here. Thank you. So there it is. The famous Mustafa. In a harsh Mustafa. So it has got sheets in and I'm going to go see if I can see a picture of Brandy on that floor. There it is. Look at this little kid. <clears throat> yeah. Might end up in there. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just got a picture of Gordon Ramsay. Okay, let's walk out this way. So there's the clay pots. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Is it um, every single shop is the same, look? Yeah. Alright guys, well I am full of lamb. I know, that was an awesome lunch though, I totally recommend it. It, it turns out delicious. all of those little shops, I thought it was like five shops serving the same thing. I think they're all the same shop. They're all yeah. Sheila Mean. Yep. I think it's Sheila Mean something Mustafa. Mustafa shop, I, so. Guys, I just wanted to point out, I really like, I don't know, I think, I saw one back there and I was also putting touch it. Oh, that's good. Look. Thanks, that's good. Thank you. Right. I think we'll sign off from here, so we will see you on the next day. Don't forget to like and subscribe.